I'm back or rather I should say my camera is back because this is the third camera already so third time's a charm right hopefully it is because this is the third camera I actually had to send back two cameras and I'm on the third camera right now so there's something wrong there was something wrong with the first one so the first one was if you want an update though so the first camera the USB port broke so I couldn't charge it I couldn't do anything to it the second camera I wanted to charge it after first use I wanted to charge it but I didn't want to charge so I used my computer as usual didn't want to charge after two hours charge nothing literally and just close that and uh, used my power bank as well um, didn't charge but then it charged a bit half of it after I fiddled with it and stuff like that no reset nothing helped and so I gave up I called I mean I emailed them and I said well the camera doesn't want to charge you know it's brand new from the box pretty much I used it once I wanted to charge it doesn't want to charge and that's why I didn't uh, do really any vlogs within that time frame really, because I had my camera and I didn't have my camera it's the kind of that kind of thing um, so yeah this way this is the third camera it charges I checked it it charges so that's fine that's great it uh, works perfectly fine as far as I'm aware that uh, there's no clanking sound inside there's nothing loose inside of it I shook it and I tried nothing great that's very good I love it now I'm not very fussy person not to you know don't get me wrong I just want my camera to work I don't really want anything else from my camera so as long as it works I would never contact Drift for you know for any replacement for anything for any repairments as long as it works I have no problem with this camera whatsoever but because it didn't work I was pain in the butt in Drift's butt to be honest and uh, I told them, you know, I want the camera to work and I don't give a shit. You want, I paid for it and I want a camera that works. Charges every time and, you know, works every time. So it saves the files and stuff like that. And they send me the third camera and hopefully it will work now. Right, so a bit of an update, I think it should be good. Because I haven't used uh, to do any vlogs. I didn't have a camera. So I didn't do any vlogs. For some time now now I do already have the ticket for MCN motorcycle show and uh, it will be on Saturday 16th this month which is February are you turning or not for fuck's sake mate I'm giving you space so if you want to you can meet me on Saturday on 16th it's in two weeks time two weeks time and it's a motorcycle show MCN motorcycle show in London at Exxon so if you are interested, uh, the tickets cost £18, one eight, eighteen pounds and uh, you also have to pay £1.50 for a fee, so together nineteen fifty for a ticket. That's just for the transaction, if you, if you buy five tickets you still just pay £1.50, nothing else. That's per transaction, not per ticket. Um, I'm going towards my brother, that's why I'm doing this vlog, I'm going towards my brother, I'm going to visit him and uh, that's my pretty much uh, journey destination and I just wanted to update you guys a bit that I do have my camera now I we will talk about something else in a moment but I do have my camera I have my tickets which I will be going to the MC and motorcycle show on Saturday I'll be there from the morning from maybe 9 30 10 o'clock ish something like that I'll be already there if you want to meet me you can you know you're welcome to buy a ticket with me over there and um, you'll probably recognize me by my gear that's what I'm, I'm gonna wear and maybe uh, we can do a meetup over there so if you want to obviously I don't have a very big audience and everything so if you see it and if you would like to meet me over there as a fellow biker I have nothing against that do go ahead and book those tickets and uh, so those are the updates I really talked about in the past um, now the update about my bike 
Now, as you can see, oh, if you have if you have uh, followed me on my Instagram, you already know that I damaged my bike due to the ice conditions on the road. I was going to his work in the morning. It was freezing. It was uh, zero degrees centigrade, and uh, there was some ice on the streets, especially the side streets. You know, where you have like um, houses and everything, not the main streets. And towards the end of the journey, like two minutes left towards where I wanted to go. Two minutes away from my destination, there was a roundabout and I, don't, I didn't have a camera. Obviously, I didn't have a camera. And uh, two minutes from that roundabout, not on that roundabout, a van behind me was fucking sitting on my tail. And I thought, nah, fuck it. I, I would normally go in the um, kind of... Uh, inner section of the circle on the roundabout but I did on the outside circle and there was a patch of black ice I couldn't see it I saw it when actually I almost went on it and I thought no nothing I cannot do nothing about that though there's nothing I can do really I cannot break because if I break that's that's hundred percent crash so I went through it and I and I fell um, and I slipped anyway you know it just I couldn't steer through it because uh, the van next to me was you know in the other lane so i couldn't do it i couldn't break because if i broke you know, it, the same thing would happen the same thing would happen and uh, why are you going on the oh you want to overtake some traffic are oh, you motherfucker crafty one are oh, you gonna go on to pass lane you nah good and I slipped pretty much, you know, on, on black eyes, really. I didn't see it until I I actually went on it, almost, almost went on it, you know, I could see it, but there was just no time to, to put any type of reaction. Either go through it and you won't fall, or you break and you will fall, because obviously if, you, if I broke you will fall. Obviously I slipped, it wasn't very fast, like 10, maybe something like that miles an hour, it's not a, anything major, but my bike did fell down onto the right side and in overall there is some damage to it as I said on my Instagram my front lever brake lever was broken so I, you can see the replacement I ready um, so I have a replacement already installed and you can see that on my Instagram as well Wait a minute, wait a minute, mate. So you can see that on my Instagram as well. And uh, besides that, my crash bank on the right hand side got broken. And not broken, sorry, it bent. It bent uh, due to you know, 200 kilograms, this bike, you know. And it's a good thing that I had it actually, because if I didn't have it, then the plastic fairing this one over here if you can see it through the steering wheel uh, wheel um, bar if you can see it um, it will probably break and the radiator could be damaged as well although probably the plastic would protect it but the plastic would be much more expensive than a a lever and a bracket so i bought the bracket actually already and the same type so i have the same type of bracket i found it on the internet 37 quid only and a free delivery as well so i bought it you know it's it would be a shame not to buy them and it's pair so if i crash again then i have a bracket to change it uh, other than that you know the the kind of protector thing the slider is not included in that kit but i don't really need it because i already have one so there's no point for me to have it i, I don't care that much and my brake lever, the back brake lever, the foot brake lever, or rather to say, uh, is bent. I kind of like the design of it, but it's bent. It's not... I can use it, as you can see, look, I'm slowing down. So I can use it. No problem whatsoever. I don't have a problem using this lever. It's just that it's bent and it's annoying me as hell. Other than that, the exhaust got a bit scratched. Uh, so I scratched the exhaust a bit 
and uh, I scratch this a bit over here and my mirror as well and that's pretty much it there's no other I think I scratched the plastic a bit still not visible that much um, but that's pretty much it so no real damage to the bike fortunately and I'm quite quite happy with that you know uh, no brakes on the steering wheel uh, it's weird. why the hell is it steering wheel it's steering bar as well we have steering bars on on the on the motorcycle um yeah the mirror is a bit scratched over here but it doesn't matter these are not stock mirrors that's i i found out actually when i searched for parts these are replacement parts but they're not original original are black that's why i thought you know they're not original parts and they're not but they fit the bike so i'm not gonna change them for now and they cost like 50 quid one so i don't give a shit i'm not gonna i'm not gonna actually change them they're too expensive to change just like that on my whim um so yeah those are the really the updates and so i do have my camera i do have my tickets my bike works and um, my back brake works my front brake works and uh, my heated grip wo uh, grips work um, i'm going to mcn motorcycle show maybe i'll buy some new gear and then i can just review it for you guys i'll be doing some reviews of my gear because i own it for a very long time now so you can expect that in the future and i do have some videos in my pipeline it's just that you know the, they didn't have a camera then my bike broke a uh, couple of days couldn't record anything even though i got the camera like two days ago i think something like that um so yeah it's just a constant stream of of unlucky things happening to me this year which i'm not this is 30 mate come on mate just just go overtake that thing um so yeah really another update really not a vlog but what can i do you know it just, ha just happens you know this is life this is you cannot expect for life to go perfect all the time you know and i surely don't expect that that's why i'm pretty much producing all new updates right now on my channel um but yeah there will be f vlogs in the future no don't worry about that don't worry there will be vlogs all right guys thanks for watching i hope you well i don't know if you enjoyed that but at least i informed you about some things and uh, if you want to you can subscribe there will be more content uh, i'm working on some content as well so surely this channel will not be about updates only i can go that way as well this is legal by the way um you can uh, follow me on my instagram and you can also read my novel my novel actually got a lot of views recently which i'm happy about so if you want to you can do read my novel the links are below in the description thanks for watching guys and i will see you in my next vlog blast out